It's round seven of 12 on the Audi FIS Alpine Ski Racing World Cup Tour for the slalom races forward to 2020. Now on the first of the two legs to be contested, it's the tour leader, Manu Fella, that's first on track, will play a serious part in the headlines for today's slalom race. That early lead is soon toppled by the French favourite out of the Val d'Isère Ski Club, Clément Noël. In the years gone by, flies the first run and takes full advantage of the early bib number. Into the second run and after a poor first run performance, Daniel Yule starts 30th, warming conditions and softening snow. 136-24, watches in the lead a further 26 skiers. Over Yule, who leads, looks good at the halfway point, all of the sectors, and loses it by to challenge. 1.53 is the advantage for Manu Fella, but difficult for the faster men from the first leg to be competitive. And to ski after disappointment from Timmy Hogan, he has enough in hand from the first run. But the bumps make it very difficult. Clement Noel is beaten into third position. It is Daniel Yule that celebrates the victory, a Swiss 1-2 with Mayar in runner-up position. Do already with a PB after the first run, but can he back it up on the second? Can Verdu give Andorra their first ever Alpine Ski Racing World Cup podium to back up that brilliant first run performance? He's going at the early turns with the same tempo and risk levels that he had the first building. 0.5 second ahead. So much risk, but look at the legs. He looks so smooth, like there isn't any ruts there. He's an older racer on the tour at 28 years of age. You know, he's 27th start, but he's showing no nerves. The composure is there. The focus is on point. Watch that clock. 0.94. This could be a magical moment for Andorra. The timing of the release of the turn very high and early over that rise ahead of himself. The timing and the flow is going very well into the closing turns. Verdu still with the green light, half a second as he comes into the closeout now. Keep that race line tight, focus on that finish, and Verdu is there! Verdu puts Andorra into the big league of World Cup racing! Verdu goes top of the table! with just four races left to go. What a day for Andorra. Fantastic technical skiing. Sukic can't believe it. Speed beautifully from top to bottom. It is a win for Alpine Ski Racing Women's Tour stops in Cortina d'Ampezzo for a double downhill and a super G this weekend. It's early with Michaela Schifrin racing her second downhill of the season and a huge crash right at the top of the challenge. Lara Goot Barami, who's won here and downhill and it's super G, has to wait experience, calm and cool attitude to downhill racing with a near flawless performance to bottom and crosses the finish line to take the lead in a time of 133.45. Four times World Cup downhill champion, winning the last three back-to-back -back for a go. But she slightly overskis the upper section. He's beaten by Gooper Army. Godja goes second, 133.77. Stephanie Benia with bib number 18 is brimming with confidence after coming off a second position. Top gear in the closeout. Stephanie Benia records her second World Cup 2019. Two pleasant surprises come from some of the lower starting numbers. Christina Aga picking up a huge PB after a courageous top section. Great style. That time of 133.77 goes third. And Val Grenier of Canada hasn't raced World Cup down since 2017. Headers in Cortina. After finishing 11th in the Super G, Grenier refines those downhill skills of old. Tishin, 133. And Barami 1 and 2 with a 3-1.